Hey y'all, it's Kitty, and today I have a bag reveal and a switching of the bags. So, I bought this bag off of Macy's.com, and the day I did it, they were having a um, extra 20% off sale items, I think it was. So, that's how I got this, and I got it really cheap. Well, considering the original price, I got it cheap. But, um... I look today, the day I'm posting this video, and they still have it, and they still have it at the extra 20% off or 25. I don't remember what it was, but it was a really good deal. So if you like this bag, you can still get it. Okay, so this brand is my second favorite brand behind Dooney and Burke, and it is Fossil. And here is the bag. It's called the Whimsical Mother's Day Large Shopper, and it's in the color Pink Floral and I saw it online and fell in love with it. Oh my goodness, this has my name written all over it. And it's got this really cute charm here. It's plastic, but I don't care. And it's got a nice front pocket. It only goes from handle to handle, but there's a front pocket. So that's how deep it is. And then on the back, it also has a pocket, same pocket, or same size pocket. And here's the bottom, no feet. I'll show you the tag, here's the tag. So it was on sale for, I wanna say 110, and then you get the extra percentage off from that. So y'all know totes and shoppers are my thing. And when I saw this, I just, I just couldn't resist it. So this is the bag I'm gonna be switching into today. And then they also had accessories to match. They had a wallet. And the wallet was also on sale. It was already on sale. And then you got the extra percentage off. So I don't remember how much the wallet was but it was really nice. Here's the wallet. And I suspect all the wallets might look different because it's kind of a big pattern. Hang on, I gotta get some scissors. Okay, here's the wallet up close. And it's got a nice zipper thing here. And it opens like this. And there's the inside. Really, really nice wallet. I actually um, prefer Fossil wallets to Dooney and Burke wa wallets. Dooney, is anybody at Dooney watching this? Y'all need to learn how to make a wallet. And stop using that freaking red plasticky stuff. I hate that stuff. It always cracks. Anyway, that's, that's my rant for the day. When it, fossil wallets are always really nice. Okay, so there's the wallet. And then you could also get a cosmetic bag. If I can get matchy-matchy, I like it. But I don't mind if I don't get matchy-matchy either. Okay. So here's the cosmetic bag. Really, really cute. Oh my goodness. I can't stand it with the cuteness. Getting the tag off here. Hang on. Yeah, this is all called Whimsical Mother's Day in pink floral. And it's got a plastic coating on the inside for easy cleaning. Fossil stuff is so good. It really is. Anyway, let me get the stuff off the handle so you can see that better because we're going to be switching into this. Y'all probably thought that I would be switching into the Sloan Hobo that I just posted a video on but I actually got this bag first and I've been wanting to switch into it for about two weeks now. Well, week and a half something. 
Besides, the past couple of purses I've carried have been doony, so I'm ready to do a fossil. Okay, here's the middle of the bag. Nothing fancy, just plain and brown. So, that's what it looks like. And then here's the cosmetic case. Really, really cute. Macy's.com, they still have it. Okay, so let's tilt the camera and do a switching of the bags. Here is the current bag I'm carrying. The large Zip Barlow. And that's what it looks like on the inside. I did, a, I filmed a switching of the bags into this bag, but I didn't like it, so I never posted it. So I don't usually keep anything in that pocket and then one of these side pockets I keep my phone okay so let's switch out my wallet first here's the wallet I've been carrying it's a hobo Lauren wallet and then it has two side compartments like that. So I'm going to be switching in to this wallet. Okay, I've switched into this wallet. I put the cash back there, cards there, and I did not use this zipper thing because I usually keep a separate coin case. So there's that. Let's put it in the bag. And next I'll switch out my cosmetic case and I'm moving into this one. This cosmetic case is way too big you know, for what I need it for, but it's so pretty I couldn't resist using it. So that's what I have inside. I have a little folding pair of scissors. These are really cool. I got these off Amazon. Some band-aids. A glass fingernail file. Always use glass. Some feminine wipes, some blotting papers, some lip balm. This is where I keep Advil and aspirin and stuff. It's a little pill box. Really cute. I think that's from Brighton. And then I have some brush picks. These are really good for when you're out. And then I have a little pair of tweezers and a mirror. This mirror actually matches the pill box. I think these are Brighton. Yeah, they're Brighton. Could probably find them on eBay if you wanted. And then I have another band-aid and a little pair of nail clippers. And then I'm not sure why I have two, but I have two. These are lip brushes, and they actually um, fold up so the brush doesn't get all inside your stuff. Okay, so there we go. Ooh, I'm so excited to use this bag. Okay, here we go. And then I have my pens. I think I have a pencil in here. It's just a, it's just a Hello Kitty pen pencil case I got off eBay. And then I have my glasses. I usually stand those up in the corner. And then I have my car key. It just sits in the bottom of my purse. And then I have a baggie with two Aleve in it. I'm actually going to take them out of this baggie and put them in my pillbox. And then this is what I use for my coins. I love this little bag. It's got ruby slippers on it. So we'll put that in there. And then I have a little, this is a Sephora folding brush and 
And then I have a little, um, this is actually a calendar. I don't really write anything in this. I usually just use it if I need to know a date. So I'm going to put this. Uh, probably right here in this side pocket, just standing up like that. The problem is, is this Barlow has such nice organization. So let's take out my phone and I'm going to see if it fits. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Hmm. Seems like somebody could come along and take it though. I kind of don't know how I feel about that, but I'm going to leave it there for now. And then I have various things in this little side pocket. Okay, what's this mess? Okay, I have a little lipstick thing. This should probably go in my cosmetic case. And then this is keys for my work. A Soap and Glory Sexy Mother Pucker. Actually, if you've watched any of my uh, switching of the bags. I uh, always have this in my purse. And then I have some Addison and Gates Wild Lavender Luxury Hand Cream. I got this from um, World Market. And then this is like my favorite lip balm. It's an Erin Rose Lip Conditioner. So this one I use all the time. So I think I'm going to put it in that little side thing there along with my keys for my work and then these three things I think I'm actually going to put in the cosmetic case hand cream you know what there's a reason I didn't put them in here it's because I'm afraid they're going to like the lid's going to come off and then get over everything. So I think maybe I'll just stand them up next to the other things. There. They fit nicely like that. Okay. actually missing something and I don't know what it is. Hmm. I usually keep a little jewelry pochette thing in my purse in case I want to take off my earrings. I'll have to find it. I'm not sure why I didn't have it. And then my keys. I only have my house key on this. So I will put that right there. Oh, that looks nice. I like that. I don't like my keys down in the bottom of my purse because uh, I don't like them scratching up my wallet and other stuff. And then I have some of these clippy things. These need to go back to my office. So I'll put them in the bottom. And then I have a gift card to Cheesecake Factory that I got for, what do they call it? Secretary's Day? I don't think that's the politically correct term anymore though. Anyway, that's what that is. Yeah, Cheesecake Factory. So I think maybe I'll just put it in this front thing here. I'll probably use it really soon. Okay. And this one is now completely empty. love this bag, but time to move on. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.